ego and the alter ego are the two components of everyone. The first, the ego, is relative to the second one, being the relative ego, a true reaction to the action of the alter ego. As the third principle of dynamic, of action and reaction, teaches very well. By a mere consequence, which truly transcends our reality, the true living subject is the alter ego, being the human spirit. Therefore, the spirit, magnetically and with the antimatter body, advances in its negative time from the future time of our relative ego towards what only our ego considers the past time, because it is really the future time of the human spirit. Our spirit is uh, anti-Christ because we are spiritually, in our present time, 20 cent 21 century before the God Son, living we in the time of God Father. This truly transcends the reality of the field electric and material, because the present time of our ego is 21 centuries afterwards Jesus Christ. This evident contradiction exists because the becoming of the philosopher Heraclito is not true, but it is only a cinematic effect. The real truth is that 10 rise to zero is the simple existence all in power, but it exists also all in action as the product between 10 and 10 rise to minus 1. Everything exists simultaneously in these two forms, the synthetic of all in power and the analytic of all in action. Between these two extremes, all the combinations exist as fragments of an apparent becoming. If a spirit looks one A after the other B, we can believe that the A situation becomes the B other, doing in this way a real mistake, only laying on the equal and the contrary mistake, that first B has become A, to can afterward become B. The apparent becoming is not true one. Only in this way in which two opposed mistakes are the absolute truth, only in this way we can be simultaneously anti-Christ in the spirit and after Christ in the body of matter. Jesus explained this mystery to Nicodemo, Gospel of Saint John, chapter 3, revealing that two 
are the dynamics of the life, that of the spirit and that of the water, the molecule that in one decimeter cubed is the unit of the matter by the actual shines. By consequence, the Eleatic school was in the right. The Heraclito was wrong. The truth is the to be which exists simultaneously with all his fragments interposed between all in power and all in action. The apparent becoming certainly it appears, but it isn't true. A situation doesn't become the other situation because everything is always itself. We perceive a mutation, a becoming, passing with our observation from one fragment to the fragment that is after the first. And we have the imagination of the become, becoming. Only the imagination. Everything is only a infinite design in which exists all the possible as an enormous system of all the possibilities we name God this system because our position is one of the plenty and the plenty is what responds to ourselves in the way of our spiritual condition so if i love the system responds with love. If I am another in my spirit, the system responds in the language that I can understand. Because the system of relation between one of us and all the system is a dialectic comprehension in which is the system obliged to use our judgment because uh, is uh, always uh, the biggest to abass at the level of uh, what is uh, nothing to enter in communion with uh, his uh, limit. 